Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, Masson to you you're back for another episode of Man of Medan. Now I'm just shortening the series title to this because if I put the full title it takes up like, you wouldn't even see what the little subheading to it is. So it's just Man of Medan, part one, part two, that's how my videos will go, with a little subheading after it. So where did we left off? I got the guy I was controlling killed. Because I was like, oh wait, he's using a knife, the same knife that the, the dead friend had. It might be him. This might be a hallucination. Brad. What a Alex's brother, Innocent. What does he mean by Innocent? Like... I don't know. Like, uh, Virgin? Motivated Alex. Brad's brother, Julia's boyfriend, Insecure. Think we got enough? If we run out, we can you look like call a, you look a bit like Chris. So, uh, look, from until dawn. I've never been down there before. Down? The water, diving. Or maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious? You came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kind of. Yeah. Say nothing. Insecure. It's embarrassing. I had to work. I wanted to. I just didn't. I didn't have time, you know, I had to work all summer. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is like super expensive. Little bro, be cool. What? Julia <laughs> and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man, it's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Not good for people, I was invited. Uh, tag along? Seriously? I thought I was invited. Julia wanted you to come along. <laughs> For real? Julia? Yeah, man. She wanted you to come. And I wanted her to see how cool you are, which you're not. So be cool. Capiche? 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 Alright, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... The new medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. It's been two weeks. Must be tough. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Hey! So, uh... Can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh... Kind of the big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? What? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Wait, proposing to Julia. Go with your gut. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Whoa, 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 bearing. Yes, I knew it. <laughs> Proposal. Julia, excited, Conrad's sister, Alex's girlfriend, reckless, Conrad, Julia's brother, foolhardy, foolhardy, relaxed. Okay. I mean, you all look like, uh, oh. most of them look like they're <laughs> in their 20, Connie, this 30s. Is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss hey, man. Wanna crack a cold one with me? Every second. Huh. Uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would've gone with minutes. I get seasick. Yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah cool. <laughs> Tight. Uh, I, I love beer. My stuff went up for with Alex. Well, because I'm being cool. <laughs> right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. It's jib. Don't ruin it. Ah. You ever do any diving before? 
Nope. Never all the time. Never. Never. Um, no, actually. Never done it before. Water virgin. Nice. Hey, we're gonna pop your... Boy, what the fuck? <laughs> I think Conrad just went out there. Together. Oh. Uh... <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> Where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? Yeah, Fliss, impatient, captain of the Duke of Milan, courageous. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Uh, you're selling, I'm buying. Whoa! A bit fast. Also, I like how she's the only one that has the sense to park right next to the docks. That's it, get it all out. Uh, yeah. <sighs> You, uh, wanna go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Little boy. Right, now I'm controlling Alex. Oh, so this isn't like a until dawn. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Okay. I'm just so sure. I'm just so sure it would be here. But yeah, I mean, what are the odds we're really gonna find a needle in a haystack? I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. All right, so it's not like under the drone. You're not like controlling one. Got... Oh. Hmm. Was it Fliss that went down there or went up? There's f there's six characters, is it not? Brother, girlfriend, brother, girlfriend. No, oh, there's only four. Five, even. I'm not going to do that every single time. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, the kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Fliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine? Untouched? Yeah. We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera, see if you can find anything useful. Right out. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Oh, am I finally getting to move about? <gasps> I was just doing a bunch of watch. Oh. Binoculars. And I'll think might be away. Am I supposed to see? What's that? Is there anything I'm supposed to see here? No? Okay. Or is that just show me I, no matter what way you... How far... Ah, so there's no island that way where the binoculars were, but look, there's nothing. Hey, hey. Hey, oh. sweetie. 
Almost got the gear good to go. Thanks for peeing. So, thanks again for springing for the good stuff. Nice to be able to do it right. Uh-huh. What? You know the size of my bank account is not in a competition with the size of your penis, right? <laughs> I still go good. I want equal contribution. But if it was a competition, I'd still do pretty good, right? Well, if you adjust for inflation, gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. <laughs> yeah, I know. Let's just play cool for now. Cool? Why? There's no point in antagonizing her. If she tries to keep me from doing this dive one more time, that's it. Gloves off. That's fair. Just don't force her hand. All right. I'm going to get these rebreathers set up, and then we'll go through the final steps together. Cool. Just holler at us when you're ready. All right, let's talk to Brad. There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Oh. I should get to look. Get, can I control it? I can. Huh. All right. Do you know how to use that? Uh, no, not really. You might want to just let it do its thing. Okay, I didn't really want to enter. I can't talk to her? Oh, okay then. Oh. Fail, fail sight the bow. This doesn't look kosher. Okay. Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Take more than that just to screw up the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Yep. I'm going for here now. Sure, Julia left anything on the mainland. Perfume. This only smelled as good as it cost. At least it made her happy. Well, we'll be able to pick up anything else. No, it's just down to. Okay. Okay. What? Oh yeah, he said something about So the promotion that the pictures picture frames are like this game's totems. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay. O2 check done. Whoa, 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 Eager Beaver, you
you gotta check your O2 first. Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Nah. <laughs> oh, that's a blade. Um. What are they? One's a camera, one's a baton. Taking the damn weapon. I got the bang stick. Good to go. Oh, that about you. Ha ha. You ever have to use one? On a shark? Nope. Later tonight, Fuss's attitude. Maybe we can fire it up again tonight for our private post dive special. <laughs> Are you gonna bring your bang stick? <laughs> <laughs> that front cabin sure. is gonna pop its portholes. <laughs> oh, well, I had to take it anyway, okay. Dive, dive, dive. Wonder if I'll get to control the divers. This is going to be a bunch of cutscene. Oh, you good? More or less. Not shark. She been flesh is so tight. She acts like a. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That's cheap. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. <laughs> Let's move around a little and find a way in. Shit. Plus. Divers. Plus, shark defense water. Not a good idea. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You? Are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. <laughs> Pass, I need to focus. Sure. Sure. Why not? I want everyone to like everyone. Pretty nice ride you got here. It's probably Where'd impossible. You get uh, a little bit of money, long shit story. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Whoa. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Weather looks clear. Hmm. I'll have to keep an eye on those clouds. That's a spinning tornado. Uh-oh. It's getting mighty crowded out here. Hello again, little blip. What you doing all the way out here? Is that blip a sh shark or does it mean a ship? I've already interacted with this. Too late, I already saw it. Well, oh, Alex already saw it. I wonder. Will, uh, will she be able to see live footage or this just wow. pictures? That is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. Okay. Same pictures. Let's go and talk to him. 
let me talk to Excuse me. Hey there. How's it hanging? You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. Are you beached to charm? It's bad charm isn't among Yes. It's too bad charm is not among them. Ah, but my charm is like a boomerang. You think it's gone right over your head until smack. You're out cold. That makes no sense. <laughs> you need to mind the speed limit. You have to keep track of dive, but romantic. I have to keep track of the dive, but I'd be happy to continue this conversation later when I can give you my full attention. In private? Private. Just just chatting it up, you and I, in the old conversational intercourse. <laughs> Damn, you just fucked up. See ya. Hmm. Can she analyze the picture? Will it show me the same thing? Ah, it will show me nothing. Okay. Wonder if I missed it. Would it, would it not me show? Would it just count as like a totem and just like, hey, you missed it? Oh, now it's open. <gasps> Another picture. Get in there. Another picture. Look at the picture. What is it? It is a man with a gun. Why do I keep these around? Boy, until dawn was uh, bad enough to avoid How's it. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. Go eat a booth. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope <laughs> the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Uh, what do you know? Uh, they know what they're doing. What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was actually anything there. What got you into World War II? How did you figure it out? What got you into World War II? Just stuff I read about in school. Then I found out my grandpa was in the Navy. Got lots of medals. I wanted to understand what he'd been through. Got me hooked. Okay, fair enough. Interested you you can use those old stories. I hope they respect the site. You can actually use all those old World War II stories to help them find the sites? Yeah. You know, when they started wreck diving, I realized I could be a pretty good resource. I knew a lot about where, where planes would go, shipping routes. You make a lot of connections. Alex and Julia have done a lot of dives, but I gotta say, finding this plane takes the cake. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. Okay. Now what will she say if I go in here? Oh. <laughs> if it gave me the option to, to take it, I'd laugh. I mean, I've already... I've already... Get that, get that down. You're saying nothing. That I don't like. Music, stop now. Thank you. There we go. Hey, Fliss. Look, there's a boat. What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? This feels off. Be quiet, mommy. This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Um Hey, we got damage here, you see this? Look at our boat! We can take care of this man, it's not a problem. What do you think? Like uh ten bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it twenty. 
Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. He looks like a zombie, and I don't like it. Hmm, where are they? The graphics. Looks so good. That underwater effect. So. Like when you're up on Earth, you just see for ages, and it will only be when like it goes out of sight. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really? Well, the rear turret. Huh. Good on you, Connie. South Pacific website. The wreck turret. site. You can get in through there. She touched something. I'm about to say that thing's sharp. Oh, careful. Could be dangerous. Why didn't you move that before you went in? Uh, ladies first. Oh. <gasps> just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? Ah, oh. oh, fuck. Okay. Nope, same thing. Nope, nope. Julia, leave it. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Maybe it is kind of dangerous. Okay, what am I looking at now? A bullet. Yes, it's a bullet. Bullet holes, all down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. Okay. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Keep going. Push on ahead. Good God. Lock it. Oh, poor guy. Wow. What the hell happened here? A little look at things. They knew they were goners. Okay then. Uh, oh. uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. <laughs> oh. Sh the thing, the thing shoots. Get the gun. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, oh. fuck! I think I wet my wetsuit. When life gives you lemons. Ew. Oh, you bugger. Pilot and co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Alright, sorry. Stop for a moment. Please. He's 
holding something. No, no, already. Uh, What else can I do? He's holding something. I mean, I've already looked at this. Is there something else in here I can interact with? It doesn't look like anything. This is wanting me to swim out of here now. Nah, he's staying there. Huh. Exit. <gasps> Shark. Oh God, Alex. It's a gray weed shark. Not interested in us. Let's go. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time. Right time? I, I don't... I guess. Oh. I know you can't tell, because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh-huh. Julia, will you marry me? You're shitting me, right? What? <laughs> like there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh... Okay, come out, guys! The gig is up! Julia, I'm serious. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? Yes! Yes! I'll marry the shit out of you! <laughs> Boy, by both their eyes, they don't look fucking... Ugh. Alright, handsome hero. You wanna get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? Flint, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where did the boat come from? Um. Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Damn it! Yeah. Okay. Decompress. Right. I'm going. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey, JJ, don't worry about it. Oh, nothing. Your brother just took it upon himself to blow up my grill. Conrad, what is wrong with you? What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. First of all, can we just take a note that he's proposed and she met, he met his brother, her brother, 
Can't speak. She, he met her brother the day. Okay, back to the therapist guy. <laughs> You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Yeah. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. Mm. And then there's Captain Fliss. Strong, forthright, stubborn. Do I detect a spark between her and Conrad? Yes. Let me reassure you. You help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some I think they may regret. Yay, I love it when people regret. Okay, well, I'm going to end that episode here. Please, if you liked it, drop a like, and I'll hope to see you in this episode. Bye.